Hi everyone, Brenda Sanchez, certified training partner with Mailbox Power. And today I want to show you how to add a contact or a group to an automation. So now you've created all these automations. Now, how do you make them go out to your recipients? So again, I'm in my automations right now. And again, over here on the left, you're going to see the automations menu. When you get here, I'm going to go and show you how to add people to this birthday demo. So I'm going to go to manage recipients. And now you're going to see that birthday demo is already added. But if I wanted to enroll another group, I could come up here and click on enroll a group. And then here's my female birthday group. So I could say enroll this group and you want to click this button, not this, because this will take you to the list of everybody that's in there. So we're going to click on this button right here. And you're going to see now that it just populated a whole bunch of names over on the right. So that's how you add a group. If you wanted to add an individual, you could come right here to enroll a contact. And let's just pull my name up. And I'm going to scroll down. And if I wanted to add me, I'd check this box and scroll to the top and say enroll in the automation and say yes. And so now I was just added to the automation. If I want to unenroll people, I can hit the unenroll here or I can come unenroll a group the whole group. So I'm going to say unenroll and that will take everybody away on the right hand side except me. And if I wanted to unenroll mine, I could hit unenroll. So now I've shown you how to enroll a group and how to enroll a contact from automations. But the cool part about Mailbox Power is there's lots of ways to add people to your automations. So you see that I have my birthday demo group already attached to this. So if I were to come over here to contacts and I search for myself, and I come down and here is Brenda Sanchez. If I click on this box, notice I have two options here. I can assign to a group and I already know that group is attached to the automation. So I could come right here and say assign to the group and I could come down here and look for birthday demo. And I could click that and I would be added to the group, which would get added to the automation, or I could click enroll in automation. So I'm gonna click enroll in automation, and then I can come up here to birthday demo and say add. And now if I go back over to my automations, you're gonna see in the birthday demo that it automatically added me. The other way you can do it is from contacts. There's one last way is from contacts. Actually, there's two ways. From contacts, you can come here to edit a contact. So let me let me go to, actually, I'm going to pick somebody else. Let me pick Andrea. And here's Andrea Shepard. So if I edit her contact, and I come to groups, as I'm adding her into my system, you can see that I can pick the groups. And if I come down here to birthday demo, right here, it says that that enrolls her in the birthday demo, and then I can hit save. So that's another way. The last way, like I said, there's lots of ways I can come down here to birthday demo. And now I have a link to this group and you can see Andrea's in here. If I right click on this and copy this link address and send it to somebody via a text message, via Facebook Messenger, LinkedIn, email, whatever, and ask them 
to please fill out the link, I would say something like, I love celebrating birthdays. Would you mind clicking on this link and filling it out so that I can celebrate you on your birthday? So those are all the different ways. As you can see, there's lots of ways to enter contacts or groups into an automation. So we make it super easy for you to add people so that you can save time and make more money with Mailbox Power.